Your WCBI First Alert AccuWeather Forecast with meteorologist Vanessa Alonzo. Friday morning. Thank you so much for starting off your day with us here on Sunrise. The time now is 448. We have a cold front that's going to be pushing through today. That's going to be bringing us some chances of rain for your Friday. And unfortunately, it's looking like it will be around for Friday night high school football. So keep the rain gear handy throughout the day today into tonight. And then we are in for a cloudy and cooler Saturday for us. Now temperatures will warm back up as we start the new work week, but there is a little bit of un some uncertainty in the forecast for next week as we could be dealing with some big changes or not. It all depends on the forecast with a very strong cold front that could push through. So it could make a difference in our temperatures and our rain chances for next week. Of course, something we'll be watching very closely heading into the weekend. At least this morning, all is pretty quiet for now. We've had a few clouds begin to move in this morning. So far, our Alpha Insurance Skycam in downtown Tupelo is not showing any issues on Main Street, as many of you are probably beginning to head out the door this morning for your Friday morning commute to work or school. In Columbus, all is quiet as well. Fifth Street looking pretty good in downtown. Temperatures for the most part this morning, once again, in the mid to upper 60s. And eventually, we are going to be warming up again over the next several hours hours into the 70s and into the 80s. But changes again will be heading our way. All thanks to this cold front that's right now pushing through the central place this morning. Bring some rain from Iowa down into Missouri, Kansas, Oklahoma, and Texas. All of this activity will be heading in our direction. So we will have a chance for showers and thunderstorms today. About a 40 to 60 percent chance, especially heading into the afternoon, into the evening hours. High temperatures ahead of the front will be in the lower to mid 80s thanks to that southeast wind. Once the cold front starts pushing through here, our winds will switch up to the northeast and that's what's going to usher in that cooler air. But look at this heading into Friday night football, about a 40 percent chance of some showers, maybe some rumbles of thunder. So keep the rain poncho handy just in case if you do encounter some rain at those high school football games. Here's a quick look at your hour by hour forecast for today. Clouds are going to continue to increase over the next several hours. By midday, the front will start pushing into the Tennessee Valley region and start heading here around 4 p.m. lasting into the evening hours. The cold front should be out of here after midnight and then we'll be dealing with some cloudy cooler conditions behind it for your Saturday. Sunday we'll see a little bit more sunshine warming up and then all eyes will be on our cold front next week determining how much rain we'll get and how cool we're going to get. So stay tuned. Now here's John. Following a disappointing